Our next Peabody goes to the GMA network for the breadth and scope of their investigative reporting into atrocities taking place in the Philippines. Ulungan ng mga preso kung tawagin ng mga kabataan na nagtatrabaho sa pabrika ang paggawa ng Alrem Foods. Kung akala niyo may bahid na ng kalupitan ang hitsura ng pabrika sa labas, hintayin niyong makita kung anong hitsura ng loob. At dito na rin gumagamit ng kasilyas, animoy isang impyerno para sa kanila. Mang Fred, dito ho nakatira yung uh, labing anim ba na trabaho doon? Uh, bakit ho ganito ka, ka init, ganito ka dumi? Hindi ba? Gitnang round pa lang daw kasi, halata na ni Chino na masyadong matindi ang laban. Bugbog na bugbog na ang buksingerong si Andagan. Pero sa halip na ipatigil nga ng referee ang laban o di kaya higpitan, pilit daw niya itong... Sa ganitong pagkakataon, kailangan mo ng oxygen. Dahil itong batang ito ay walang hangin. Niyuyug-yug nila. I mean, talagang violently niyuyug-yug. You were trying to wake him up. Kidneys for sale. Nakakalungkot, pero totoo. Sa sobrang kahirapan sa buhay, marami na sa ating makababayan ang nakapagbenta na ng kanilang laman loob. Ibiris namin yung kidney. De Depende ko sa... Ibiris ng kidney. Halimbawa yung right, uh, left side mo, nag-ibiris ng 76, tapos yung right side mo, nag-ibiris ng 79, sinukuha nila yung 76 yung pinakamayan na yun. Here to accept the Peabody is Jessica Soho, who's the reporter, producer, and host for the GMA Network. I share this with my colleague, Jay Tarouk, who did that wonderful piece on child labor for our program, Brigada Siete. Leo Sanchez, my producer for Eyewitness, our cameramen, crew, and staff, our bosses, Marisa Flores, Roberto Barrero, Dan de Padua, Butch Jimenez, and Mr. Menardo Jimenez. As we receive this award in behalf of our station, GMA Network, in the Philippines, we have colleagues out there covering various conflicts in our country, and to them, we dedicate this award. Also, to the subjects of our stories, the men who sold their kidneys, the former boxing champ, champs who are still struggling, and the child laborers. For us to even be here and be counted among the broadcast industry's very best is indeed an honor that we give back to our country and to God. We've come all the way across the world to get this, and we are honored to be winning this for the very first time ever for our country, the Philippines. Mabuhay ang Pilipinas!